The first play is a pop pass to Amari Rogers, and he gets the corner stiff. He's played in the past in that nickel spot, at that slot corner. Now he's playing out to the field. He'll have to be on, more, on point tonight as well. There he is. And on the run, ETN. Film study that they can get the ball to the outside with quick runs and quick passes out on the edge. Barnes gets it out of hands quickly. And on the run is ETN. Such a dangerous weapon. And Linebackers made it tougher on Borland because they couldn't get out there and quit in time because of that screen. 26-yard game. Now Lynn J. Dixon spelling ETN takes the pitch. And it Rodgers in motion again. Lawrence fakes the pitch and is hit as he throws over the middle. That was worn down. Buckeyes have been outstanding in this department, allowing only 34% this year. They bring pressure. And Lawrence off the back foot. Lost it downfield. It's just with the ball under thrown to the outside. He's just not able to adjust. ETN on the handoff. Muscles down to the two. Big shoes to fill in the secondary. On second and goal. Lawrence keeps it. Tries to get the edge. Chased by Browning. Dive. Touchdown, Tigers. Zone read with Trevor Lawrence. You see this a lot from this offense. You got to respect ETN in the middle. And then it's a foot race. Browning trying to get out there. Cooper trying to get out there. Amari Rogers with an outstanding. Howell on Banks on the left side. Single coverage. That was the matchup Lawrence looked to last time on third down. Plenty of time. Launches downfield. And he had the tight end. And did exactly what they needed to do. If you're a fan of speed chess. This is your kind of game tonight. So the Tigers back to work. Lawrence keeps it, puts it in the flat to Braden Galloway. And the tight end is knocked down on the far fence. Just lost Galloway for a big game. Tight end's a big part of the offense this year for Clemson. Didn't have a single touchdown catch last year. Lawrence finds time in the pocket and delivers a strike to Rodgers, who takes for Trevor Lawrence in this system. Within 10 yards now, with 1,000 receiving yards on the season. ETN takes the pitch on the edge, spins back, but is swarmed. That touchdown run in his first three carries, of course, had the big reception in the touchdown drive. Play action, they flip it to him again. And wide open is Travis Etienne. And it's another first down. Before Rodgers is a decoy, baiting the defense and then getting the ball back to the outside. Play action throw again. Rifle far side, Frank Ladson, who's just returned. And now it's the Tigers' turn to answer, playing from behind for the first time tonight. They fake the pitch to Dixon and pitch it long downfield and not turning around by Sean Wade downfield. Wade a consensus All-American this season. Pitch it in the far side. Again, this is Rodgers and he's knocked down. Let's go to Tom on the Clemson side. As we discussed, keep an eye on cramping for ETN. And nerves can create cramping, of course. Tigers need four on third down. ETN, the receiver there, but that was an inaccurate throw. It was by South Bend. That was without Skalski's leadership in the middle of that defense versus when they played him with Skalski in Charlotte. It was a different team. ETN, by the way, called fair catch, so they take over at the 25. It's Laura. From the team really grimacing and obviously in pain from that right side. Thanks, Maria. Meanwhile, Lawrence batted down to the line of scrimmage. Now it's... Good job of getting that left hand up to knock the ball down. It's a screen. Rodgers comes back, but he's dragged down behind the line. But it's different. Affects the continuity of what this offense has been about all year. Big time. They're off the script now. They have to react on the fly. Powell makes a catch in traffic. Spins. Doesn't quite get. 63 yards for the interception. Sets up Clemson. And now beginning of the long climb for Lawrence and company. Their first possession. It's a long throw. And the catch by E.J. Williams on the far side. Tom? This game, not to realize that they need a home run but to put together successful drives and series to chip into this lead. Wonder if they get Amari Rodgers involved, Tom. On the edge there, Rodgers held it as 27 receive plays. They're going, kind of going back to that, hitting those edges. So they take a shot on second and short. Lawrence delivers a short strike, and the catch is made by Brandon Speck. That's with pressure several times tonight. Etienne, a quiet first half running the ball. Nice forward for eight. Travis as a Trevor Lawrence, we thought we'd see their legs more involved and really didn't see a lot of that. This time Garrett slowed just a bit because he's that time by Banks getting that right hand around. 
Nice play of the drive. Lawrence flips it in the flats. Howe stretches for the pylon. Touchdown! And the Tigers. 24-yard gain. Tigers looking to strike back quickly. Lawrence looking to run all the way. And he'll be dragged down behind the line of scrimmage by Togiai. And the ball's on the ground. Ohio State say it's a turnover. Back to your teammates. And he has become a vocal leader. Lawrence to Powell, who scampers out of bounds. Uh, really, really difficult to score on this year. Lawrence flips it over the head. In fact, nobody's been able to catch up. Well, guys, bring some pressure. Lawrence throws up his back foot, and it's dropped. Wow. The tough night continues for Travis Etienne. Hasn't done a lot running or receiving and didn't pick up that blitz. Lawrence again under pressure, tried to get the ball on the edge. Ches Malusi doesn't have a touch tonight, is now in the backfield. Buckeyes are showing some pressure, but they back out. Four man rush. Lawrence has the ball batted down. Before, watch him over Trotter. Watch him just work into that backfield, pushing Carmen into the backfield, and eventually gets close enough to Lawrence where he can get up and use that left arm to knock the ball down. Interior of the offensive line of Clemson that ran right through Notre Dame in the last game. Again, Lawrence pressured, flings the ball to the turf. Dave. Last time you were on the field and the way you lost the game, I, I don't think him ranking him 11 had as much to do with it as the game last year. That was the focus. That was what these played. The big catch sets up the Tigers at the 12. And Lawrence for the end zone. It's played in pain with such great determination and toughness seen few things like it in all the years I've watched this sport, frankly, Kirk. I think of one. I mean, it, it, you're right. This will be remembered, not just for the, the execution, but for the way he was able to fight through pain. Lawrence almost lost the ball again and is dragged down by... And they've been putting a lot of pressure on, on uh, Trevor. Fourth down here. Final flicker of hope for Lawrence and the Tigers. Throws off the back foot to the end zone and it's intercepted on the carom. It's seven banks. And banks just weaves